what's going on guys it's your boy andy matrix and many people hate griffith you know he seems to be one of those characters that get what they want and get away with murder and just that's just the type of character that we hate right they get what they want and they get away with murder they they do something horrible and they get away with it and everybody's just anxious absolutely just waiting waiting for the moment that they get you know that that justice is served you know so after he became an apostle it was very obvious that his plans had changed having his own kingdom was still part of his plans but he plotted something way bigger so what is griffith planning i've been thinking i've been thinking a lot okay and he has a demon army he built his own kingdom. Recently, he got a hold of Casca, protecting his weakness. I made a video about this. He has everything a king would want, but his desires are beyond human. Let me explain. Griffith is basically the Antichrist of Berserk. <laughs> you know, if the devil was a human, he would be a really beautiful woman. You ever watched that movie, Bedazzle? Yeah. That, that, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> so Griffith presented himself as a hero by winning a battle and rescuing the innocent. He, he does not try to win over people by forcing by force, right? Although he could rule by force as Femto, right? But that is not what he wants. Okay, Griffith wants people to follow him by their own will. He wants people to look up to him, okay? His power comes from the, his ability to bring people over to his side. He's always been good at that, right? I mean, he, I mean from the very beginning, he won guts. Um, he, he's made deals with, with kings, with kingdoms. He's really good at getting people over to his side. That's just an ability that he has. It's a skill that he's learned over the years, right? Okay, that is why he built a kingdom so that he can surround himself by people that trust in him okay that is why he keeps casca in a safe place in a luxurious place he makes you feel comfortable enough to the point where you don't want to leave that is what he did with guts when guts joined the band of the hawk in the very beginning okay it was the same thing with rickard okay he wanted rickard to stay in falconia because he knew that rickard had no idea what had happened uh, during the eclipse until of course Rickard find out <laughs> and pimp slapped him that was beautiful good job Rickard look at how he treats Casca after kidnapping her from the elf island he puts her in a nice in a nice safe place comfortable luxurious place so that she won't leave it's like when somebody is paying this as if somebody's paying for your hotel they pay for your food they pay for your transportation they pay for all of your needs all of your needs are covered right so you become reliant on this person. He does this because he knows that Casca is his weakness because of the moon child. So this is a part of his game plan to protect his weakness, right? Now, uh, Griffith destroyed Flora Spirit Tree. Uh, that was when Guts got the Berserk Armor. Griffith caused the, uh, the disappearance of the Elf Island. Uh, with the spirit tree, right? Uh, Griffith has been sending his demons, his demon army, to destroy spirit trees around the world. Once all the spirit trees are destroyed, the only spirit tree left will be the one in Falconia in Griffith's kingdom. He purposely built his kingdom around the world tree. Purposely. He built his kingdom around the world tree. I want you to think about that. Again, it's all part of his plan. So he gets, he destroys all other spirit trees, but he he built his kingdom around the world tree. Right? So if he destroys all the world trees, there will only be one left, and that is his spirit tree. Right? This is the reason why Berserk, why uh, Griffith fought the Kushan King. 
who was getting in who was getting in the way of his plans. After the Cushion King was destroyed, the World Tree appeared. Right? Again, this is all part of Griffith's plan. He is no longer human. He is now working with the God Hand. Okay, he is bringing people to Falconia, and they must be willing to follow him by their own free will. You know, for his plan to work. That's why. That's why he's creating an illusion. That's why he's creating all these lies, right? Uh, because it seems as though, just like the sacrifice of the eclipse, Griffith is preparing for an even bigger sacrifice. Or they got him, right? But, um, hey, you know, that's just a fan theory after being a Berserk fan for more than a decade. What do you guys think? Comment below, like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell. Uh, it's your boy Andy Matrix. Godspeed, baby.